set. Steam rising off the two packs, a great nudge here. The penalty's coming the way of Exeter, but they've decided to keep it tight. They're going for the line and down. And Sam Simmons adds to his tally this season. It's four tries already. From this sort of range, if you don't scrummage well against them, then you're going to be in trouble. Line-out ball will be collected by Skinner again. Sam Simmons has it. Once again with that ball formed, Ewers weighs in, plenty of power towards the line. Simmons is underneath it. Have they got it down? So, Stu, I'm coming up to you. My on-field decision is try because we've got a grounded ball. Can we check any reason why we can't award it? OK, understood. The question Good. is the all-important one. Is there any reason he can't award a try? So there has to be conclusive evidence here that the ball is not grounded. Well, there's Sam Simmons with what looked like a rugby ball. Yeah. There it is. That looked like a good shot there. That, that was a good angle. Yeah, both, both, ang both angles show that the ball was grounded. Right. No that, reason. Yeah, you can award the try. Thanks so much, Steve. Yeah, b both angles show the ball was grounded, so it's going to be a try, all right? Use. Advantage over. To Glanville calls for it, but Exeter come up with it. Solid pour back to Kirsten. Simmons. Well, Little nudge forward for Aflati. That's a wonderful kick. Aflati could get on the end of it instead. He follows it forward. Aflati in the straight foot chase. Aflati can win this for a brilliant try. Unbelievable skills from Tom Aflati. Simmons kick just beyond him. He elects to volley it forwards. And the laughter going on out, out of the pitch is just... because people can't believe what they've just seen. Great bit of counter-attacking play just beyond him. Little nudge off the outside of the boot. And the ball set up perfectly, and he won the foot race. Tom Aflati with a little touch of footballing genius. Line-out ball will be taken by Skinner. Maul is for Bath managed to nudge it backwards initially, but now it rumbles up rather ominously towards the line. Held up just shy of the line. And Bath win the put-in. Sam Simmons doesn't agree, shakes his head. OK, so seven on ball. He's also around the neck with his right arm. Not only does he pull the neck, but he collapses the all. Penalty, Exeter. Skinner <laughs> rises to collect the ball. Sam Simmons has the ball in hand, and somewhere in the middle of that mall, Sam Simmons is looking Sorry, what say, to drive himself towards the line. Once again, Bath bring them initially to a standstill, and it is a penalty try. Bath warns. They pull it to ground. And Christoph Ridley will now return with his hand in his pocket. So Josh McAnally goes to the pin. The bonus point try is scored by Exeter. It's a penalty try. That's another really good drive from Exeter. Can Capstick get it right this time? In control, in control, it's your dog a Klein who touches down. Exeter at try number five. The Chiefs can sense that number six is on its way. Devoto, Witten, Witten in the corner. And the Chiefs do have that sixth try. Capstick with the charge there, and then the ball fired across, and Devoto just popping it out wide to Witten. The final score from Sandy Park is Exeter 40, Bath 3.